Judges ordinarily set a bail amount at a suspect's first court appearance after an arrest, which may either be a bail hearing or an arraignment. Judges normally adhere to standard practices. For example, they would normally set bail at $500 for a nonviolent petty misdemeanor. However, judges can raise or lower standard bail. They can even waive bail altogether and grant release OR based on the circumstances of an individual's case. In addition to the seriousness of the charged crime, the amount of bail usually depends on factors such as the defendant's past criminal record, whether they are currently employed, and whether they have close ties to relatives and the community. Also, judges may legally deny bail altogether in certain circumstances. For example, if another jurisdiction has placed a warrant on the defendant, then the judge is likely to hold that defendant in custody at least long enough to allow the other jurisdiction to pursue its charge. And bail may be denied to a defendant who is a flight risk, who will skip town and leave a jurisdiction before the case concludes. In many areas of the country, a defendant can post bail with the police before they are brought to court for a bail hearing or an arraignment. Many jails have posted bail schedules, setting forth bail amounts for common crimes. So an arrested defendant can obtain release immediately after booking by paying the bail amount set forth in the jailhouse bail schedule. 